Flag Runner. This is a very simple game which helps you learn the flags of European countries. It doesn't need a lot of space to play and it can even be played while you are traveling. The aim of the game is to name countries by looking at their flags. Setup. For this game, we only need the flag cards, so we start by removing the cards with the borders logo on the back. We then shuffle the cards and place them in a stack, flag side up. Gameplay. The first player looks at the flag on the first card and tries to remember, or guess, what country the flag belongs to. They then turn the card over and check if they were right. The country name is written in bold at the top centre of the card. If they were correct, they put the card into a pile which we call the flag run pile, country side up. If they were incorrect, then the card is placed to the side of the main deck, country side up. The next player then takes a turn looking at the flag at the top of the deck and tries to name the country. Whenever a player makes an incorrect guess and they have at least one card in their flag run pile, they turn the cards in their flag run pile over, flag side up, and they will not get another turn until every player has their flag run pile flag side up and then a new round will begin. So every time a player takes a turn, the player then rotates to the next player who doesn't have their flag run pile flag side up. So either their flag run pile is empty or they have cards in their flag run pile country side up. So if there are two players, when a player makes a mistake and their flag run pile is then turned flag side up, the other player will keep taking turns in a row until they make a mistake. When all the players' flag run piles are flag side up, they take the cards from their flag run pile and move them to the left into a scoring pile. So each player keeps a separate pile of cards they got correct. Continue this way until the flag deck is empty. When the last card is played, all players move all the cards in their flag run pile into their scoring pile. You then shuffle the cards that the players got wrong the first time and use those as the second flag deck. You then continue playing as before with one change. Cards now count double if you get them correct. To keep track of this, when you move cards from your flag run pile to scoring, you move them to the right to a new double score pile. And then you keep track that way of which cards were from the first deck and which cards were from the second deck. When the main deck runs out the second time, you stop the game and add up your points. You get one point for every card in your score pile, two points for every card in the double score pile, and the highest score is the flag runner and wins.